eight tuition free no payments no tuition you all you have to do is to study and study yes isn't that cool guys okay welcome back on my channel this is your girl Rita Weji and today we shall talk about how to apply for a scholarship in Israel how to apply for a scholarship and study in Israel all right um, we shall talk about um, application process how to apply um, the application forms selection of schools visas funding accommodation in this specific video we shall we are going to learn how to apply for a scholarship in Israel okay so guys, um, once again, my name is Rita Wedji. I'm doing masters for all those who didn't know. I'm doing masters in plant science. I'm currently in Rehovot, Israel, and I'm specializing in plant pathology. It's so interesting. It's an interesting course. So um, that's why I'm here to urge you guys to apply. All those who are interested, I'm urging you guys to apply. It's tuition free. Tuition free. I'm a Ugandan and I know the hassles of Uganda. I know really what happens in my country. So that's why I'm here to ex to share with you guys some of the opportunities that are in Israel and maybe some other countries that I could have I could be knowing. So let's get there. First and foremost, it's the application form. You need to fill in an application form. But before filling in an application form, guys, you need to know where, which particular schools, which particular universities you're going to apply to. You should make Google your best friend. You should make Google your best friend. You have to research and research. So I'll particularly talk about Hebrew University of Jerusalem. First, you can Google and type in um, universities in Israel. Or if you want Hebrew University of Jerusalem, you can go and type in apply to Hebrew University of Jerusalem and then you will get to know how to apply but since you're here I'm going to explain everything so specifically uh, my campus it's about plant science animal science nutrition and environmental science it's basically in uh, it's basically in agriculture courses but we still have in courses so guys um, we shall talk about the documents the documents needed while applying um, you need an official transcript from your university then um, of course average an average cgpa is needed like myself i got an average cgpa so secondly you need to have recommendations recommendations from your maybe your supervisors your lecturers thirdly you need a cv then you need a personal statement of course that you will write of course talking about yourself um you know and then the other thing is an English certificate and possibly an international passport of course you are coming you're traveling so you need an international passport applications started way back in November December January February and it's going to end in March so guys all those who are interested in studying agriculture courses I have just named them that is plant science nutrition animal and then environment applications start in November and they end in March so um, all you need to do is to beat up the deadline, submit in early as early as possible. Like for me, I submitted early, like I think in January, and they got back to me in f in after after two days, because you have to first be selected for eligibility after sending in your documents. They will see if you're eligible to study with them. I was eligible. Then they sent me after two days. They sent me an email saying that I was eligible to study with them. And then after that, they told me I will have an interview with them. And I expressed myself. I told them what they were asking me, and I got prepared very well. And then I answered their questions. And within one week, within one week, they got back to me. They told me I had I had succeeded in everything. And yeah, here I am. <laughs> So guys, if you really liked this video, you can like it, subscribe, guys, I urge you guys to subscribe and also share and share, share my videos so other people can get to know some of these opportunities. Uh, so, so many people out there who are doing some different courses, non science courses. So I'll share with you how to apply for some other courses and on different universities. But literally the process is all the same, guys, Google, Google and Google, make Google your friend by uh, checking important things of course and checking my youtube channel for new videos yes guys i love you so much thank you for always checking up on me thank you for always liking my videos subscribing i would love to stop here and have a nice weekend